bring forth your water, your barleys, your yeast, and your hops, and you will truly have the nectar of the gods. So the farmers and the monks did this and put this in their fermenting vessels to create the nectar of the gods. And to this day forward, we still celebrate that day by drinking the beer of the gods. And today, the Bright Brewery is still following that tradition and have made this wonderful caramelized white chocolate stout for us to taste today. So welcome all to Casey's Beer Room on this sacred day where we will do a beer review for you. So let's get into it. Thanks for joining me. So this one's from the Bright Breweries. Put my Jesus glasses on. So they say on the can, Sea Easter Desist Caramelized White Chocolate Stout, brewed for sweet tooth with a wicked sense of humor. Tendrils of caramel blend with cocoa, nibs, vanilla, lactose to recreate a caramelized white chocolate flavor and a creamy body that will transport you straight to heaven. Don't, I did read up on them. Apparently a couple of years ago they bought out the same beer, but um, because of a, um, because it looked like another brand, they um, had to go and bury them. That's what they say. They buried them and then two years later they bought it back out and recanned it so it doesn't look so much like maybe Cadbury's. I don't know what it looked like. Whether it was Cadbury's or Red Tulip or some other chocolate making fuckers. But anyway, from the Bright Brew which is in the, the um, Australian Alps down there just a bit south of uh, Wodonga, Aubrey Wodonga, you know. She's in the highlands, the snowy mountains. So we'll get her open. We'll not waste any time. Hope you've all had a great Easter. Ate all the chocolate you have today, being Easter Sunday. It's been a great day here. So we'll put her into the can. Hopefully she comes out pure white. I highly doubt that. Yeah, she's coming out golden. Looks a bit hazy from that. They say she's got sweet chocolate and coffee sort of flavors. So, oh yeah, it smells like white chocolate. It smells like a um, Milky Bar or Milky Way, should I say, or your white chocolate. There she is for you. Bloody didn't bring my phone out. That sucks. I can't take a photo of it. But anyway, doesn't matter. So she looks thick, uh, honey color. She looks a treat to me. So happy Easter. Let's have a taste and um, we'll go from there, right? Wow. Yeah. You're, you get that milky bar um, taste straight away, that, that caramelized white chocolate taste. Um, a little bit of bitterness, but not too much. Percentage, tastes pretty strong. 
Um, so let's say 5.9. So it's getting up there. It's up there with what your bloody ales and stouts and that should be. Well, it's very sweet as well. It's got that white chocolatey um, syrupy taste. Yeah, so on the Easter Sunday, this goes down a treat, especially if you're eating your Easter eggs and whatever. Um, yeah, it's quite nice. It's very, it is, it's got that velvety white chocolatey texture, bit of carbonation, a lot of bitterness. So that's a fucking send it for me on this um, long weekend Easter Sunday beautiful looking can so like I said sister and desist because if you don't the lawyers are coming after you Okay, I'll give it a rating. Um, a little bit better than Rusty Petty's Easter Choc Porter. I had one of these earlier, which is the Coles Liquorland brand Tinny's Stout. I rate that better than the Rusty Penny. And that says a lot coming from a bloody supermarket chain. But this one just had a bit more flavor, just chocolate coffee and bitter whereas this was just sickly sweet i guess this one is a little that was that one was a little bit sickly sweet as well but not as much with those um raisiny sultanery pruny plummy taste so i'll give this one look i'll give it out of five because it's easter I'm going to go all out and say 4.55556124 repeater. So that's the Bright Brewery Caramelized White Chocolate Stout review. Go and buy one if you can still get them online. They were sold out. There were still a few at Porter's at East Blacksand on Friday, Thursday, I mean. Don't know if they've got any left, but go out and try one. So whatever that score I gave it, that's what it is. It's a four point something or other, something or other, something or other repeater. And until next time, as usual. So